Hey yo, this is Longevity with BringingDownTheBand.com and the New Old Heads podcast, bringing you some hip-hop news. So with Donald Trump finally getting the hell out of office and this being the last day for him to potentially have pardons, um, it has been reported that uh, he is probably going to hand out a few. One of those related to hip-hop that has been circulating is that Lil Wayne might actually get a pardon. But sources have uh, also reported that Michael Harry O'Harris, who is the co-founder of Death Row Records, um, actually received a pardon earlier today. Uh, If you're not familiar, Harris was sentenced to 30 years in prison for attempted murder and kidnapping in 1998. Uh, But since then, he has been uh, heavily involved in prison reform uh, and so forth. So with that, uh, criminal activist uh, Alice Johnson and Snoop Dogg have been uh, involved in advocating for Harris's release, um, or pardon, I guess, if you will. Uh, Snoop Dogg actually brought the case to uh, former producer Weston Angelos, who received a pardon from Trump last month. Uh, Angelos reached out to Johnson, um, who talked to Snoop to discuss it. And it's been reported that Harris has actually been released today. Nonetheless, you guys can leave your own comments on it. And as always, if you want to get involved in discussions such as this uh, in more detail, make sure to check out the New Old Heads podcast every Tuesday from 9 to 11 p.m. Eastern on twitch.tv slash new old heads. Um, and join our private Discord community um, at nohchat.com. We're actually going to be live tonight talking a little bit about Lil Wayne's pardon. Um, and what that means, and maybe we'll jump into this a little bit as well. So tune in if you want to. All right, until next time, peace.